Hi, I'm Jocelyn with Moonlight Feather, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a feathered collar. So here's what you'll need. First off, for the feathers, you want to have two different lengths. Here we're using, for our longer feathers, the black bleach cocktails, and for our shorter feathers, we'll be using the goose nagori feathers. You're also going to need a lace trim, a black satin ribbon, and for other supplies, a hot glue gun and scissors. The first step is to measure the lace. You can either use a tape measure or you can wrap the lace around your neck and measure it that way. The next step is to cut the lace. Next, we'll be finishing the lace by cutting two pieces of ribbon and attaching them like so. And glue the inside of the ribbon and place your lace gently inside and fold it over. Take the ribbon and you're gonna wanna cut it to a piece that's about 30 inches. This will be used as the tie for the collar. Next, you're gonna attach the lace to the ribbon. You'll find the center point of each. And glue down your ribbon. As you glue, start from the center point and work your way towards the end of the lace. When you're doing this, be careful not to use too much glue or else it can seep through to the other side of the lace. Next, you're gonna take your short feather trim and you're gonna cut them into five inch strips. We're using five inch strips, but feel free to add more length if you feel it fits your um, collar better. Now that we have our two Goose Nagori strips, we're gonna repeat that step using our black cocktail feathers. And now we're gonna cut our cocktail feathers the same length. Now we're gonna take our shorter feathers and glue them to the ribbon side of our collar. Now that we have our short feathers on the collar, we're gonna repeat this step with our long cocktail feathers. So you're gonna take your feathers, do a nice clean line of glue on one side. Press it down just on top of your shorter feathers. Now you're gonna do the same to the other side. And press down gently. You can also just clean up any little hot glue strings that you have. And now we've completed our feathered collar. Make sure to check out moonlightfeather.com for all of your feather needs, where you can find all of the feathers in this tutorial, as well as more DIY projects on our blog.